Welcome back to Chaos Collectibles. So I've been working on this custom figure all weekend long and I finally just got it done. Very pleased at the way it turned out and happy that I was able to complete it today. So last time you saw it, it was a work in progress. And uh, today I'm gonna unveil it. Balsa Doom. Let's take a look at this guy here. Completely sculpted helmet, sculpted chest armor, and I got some better fur that actually matches the movie a little bit better. I did split it down the center. The cape, just like the movie. Completely repainted this bad boy. Thought about sculpting the little snake, gloves on the arms, but I didn't. I started working on it, but it was just too horrendous. And then I did the belt. Used the pleather material, sculpted the little belt buckle in the middle. And then I took two smoke Zola World knives. And then I dry brushed over them to kind of give it the snake handle look like the knives that he had in a movie. And then I cut the sheaths down ground them down just to where I had the uh, the holsters and I glued them holsters onto that belt as well. Um, I was thinking about painting the blades black considering the sheaths that he have are black but I kind of left them smoke. I may update that later but this is Thalsa Doom and I thought about doing the fur around the boots but I'm not quite that far yet. Not sure if I'm going to do it or not. Um, but yeah, this is what I have and debating on whether or not I want to, uh, and I probably will at some point sculpt the, uh, staff slash flag that they had in a movie with the two snakes facing each other with the sun. I think that would be kind of cool. And I even thought about taking the sword, long sword, and maybe sculpting like a like the little head right there, upside down head to make it look like the father sword. I think that would be kind of cool. So I'm really not sure about that yet, but I am very pleased at how this bad boy turned out. This is the completed Thalsa Doom. Snake, I washed over that with black, just like with the chest armor, washed over that with black. A lot of sculpting went into this and the cape does not cover up the shoulder pauldron, so I'm very happy with that. And this, this cape turned out a lot better. A lot better material here. So, very happy with the way this bad boy turned out. This is probably my most complex custom I've done to date. Um, a lot of sculpting went into this. A lot of work has gone into this one. Um, but I'm very pleased with the way it turned out. So yeah, there we have it. Let me know on whether or not you think I should paint the blades black on those skull man knives there. And uh, yeah, any and all feedback is greatly appreciated. Constructive criticism, whatever. I don't take myself that serious. Remember, it's always a learning experience when you start doing this stuff. You can only get better as you go, right? But yeah, that is the Thalsa Doom 5.5 custom Conan figure. All right, everybody. Thanks again for tuning in. I hope you all have an awesome day. Until next time. Woo!